Hi guys, today I want to do a video showing you all about the Young Living Aroma Glides, okay? And also teach you a little bit on how to make your own blends and how I like to blend my oils at home. So first of all, this is the Young Living Aroma Glide and it's just a roller ball that goes directly on your bottles so that you can roll right away the area that you need. Um, I love having it for lavender because you rub that on your wrists and across your forehead and all those different places. I love having it on stress away, rubbing it on the back of my neck all day long. Um, so that's what they're amazing for. And if you do one one inch strip, that equals one drop. So one inch strip of the Aroma Glide gives you one drop of oil. So this is how you get them on and off. Um, you'll hear these called the Aroma Glide and they're also called Fit Mints. Um, so they go by either name. So to get it on, let me take it off first. You simply place it in the bottle, okay? And roll the cap on. Squeeze, tighten, and it's on there. Boop. Okay, one of my favorite things about these is that it actually stores oil up in the top, so you don't have to tip it over to put it on. Um, you can do it, because I know peace and calming is really runny, so I do my peace and calming up like that to get it out so it doesn't drip everywhere. Then to get it off, you take the black cap and you just wanna put it on the edge of the silver and pop to the side, just pull it to the side and it pops it right off like that, easy breezy. Okay, so that's how you get it on and off. Um, so now I wanna to talk to you a little bit about blends. Young Living, if, it's a, if the oil is a single name like orange, geranium, or uh, lemongrass, then that's just the oil from the plant. But if it has a name like purification, joy, stress away, it's a blend. But sometimes you like to do your own blends too. So let me show you a couple blends that I already have made up. This is LLP. This is lavender, lemon, and peppermint. So this is um, for respiratory support, and it's great for those of us who have a hard time being outdoors in the spring and summertime. So the reason I have this blend ready to go with a roller ball is because if I'm gonna go outside, you do it across your forehead, on your neck, on the back of your neck, um, you know, down the bridge of your nose or whatever, um, just to help support your respiratory system while you're outside. Um, another blend I have that I love is this is Breeze Night Blend. So this is my daughter, and this is a blend I use on her feet at night. And um, I think it has, I've made it a couple different ways, but it's lavender, cedarwood, and vetiver right now. And those are all great for calming, grounding. So I put that on her feet before she goes to bed. And she doesn't wake up in the middle of the night. And um, you know, she's kind of crazy. Her craziest time of night is, her craziest time of the day is the evening. So sometimes it's hard to tell, but it does help her sleep all the way through the night, about 8 p.m. to 7 a.m. So what I wanted to show you today was, I decided that I wanted to make a perfume. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. Um, this is an old bottle of Joy, and I just wrote Joy Blend on it. And I decided that I wanted to make a perfume to carry in my purse. Um, so I love Joy, but it's really strong. It's probably one of my favorite oils, but it is really strong. So I thought, what if I blended that with something softer to uh, give it a lighter scent? So what I did, which is really funny, is I took all my oils and I took the caps off of the ones I thought would work and I just started smelling them in combination. So just kind of go like this. And go like this. So my second runner up was Joy and just plain lime. That smelled really, really good. But because Stress Away has vanilla in it, this was the winner here. And I love oils that are grounding and kind of strong scented. So I have this Sacred Mountain that smells like trees. So I'm gonna try a blend, mostly of these two with a couple drops of this. So you basically just wanna do to your own taste, to your own scent whatever you think smells good. So this is how easy it is to make a blend. I'm just gonna do eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 of Joy. So I figured I'd start with a smaller batch to see if I really like it. And then I can make more from there. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
9, 10, 11, 12, oops, 13, whatever. It really doesn't matter. Sacred Mountain, let's try five. Okay, and then mix this up. And I really like it. It's good, it's a little bit too joy for me. So let's add another 10 of Dress Away. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Because this is something I want to wear, so you want to smell good for other people. And that smells awesome. So I take this Aroma Glide, I snap it on, and there's my perfume. Bam, bam. So, anyways, I hope that was helpful and give you a better idea of what you can do with your oils and your Aroma Glides at home. Thanks.